Hey guys, we have plenty of clippers on the market, but this one has something special. I'm talking about the gold clip. Before jumping into the session, I have one license of gold clip to give away. So all you have to do to win it is leave a comment down below. I will pick a winner in two weeks. Let's hear it in action. This is gold clip. I like the interface. I think it's a great balance between options and simplicity 2D. So it's a great GUI, not with too many crazy things on display. So besides this being a clipper that has lots of options, we have different modes for the clipper from hard to classic and modern. We have the box tone. What makes this special is the gold and the alchemy. With gold, we have two different versions of it, modern and uh, classic. The gold is where the magic happens for me. This adds non-linear gain to your signal. It's different uh, from a compressor. Let's start playing with gold clip just to hear exactly what it's doing. I like having the gold clip first in the chain, especially when we are talking about two bus processing or uh, mastering. To start clipping, we can decrease the ceiling. Here you can uh, see a number minus 8 dB. If we decrease minus 8 dB, we will start to have clipping. With the box tone, you can shape a bit of the top end. This works great for modern genres, trap, rap, and uh, pop, where you need some control over the brightness of the track. We also have the option to turn the clip filter on and off. This wasn't uh, possible in the previous version, and a lot of people asked for that, so you have the option to turn it off. So you are telling uh, Gold Clip to retain all the original top end. Nothing is altered by uh, Gold Clip. I like it on. I don't mind the slight top end uh, loss. I can compensate with an EQ without any issue. When it comes to clipping, I like the modern uh, algorithm. dB of clipping and it's not breaking in a really nasty way. Also, I like the wet and dry faders. This is a really intuitive way to balance the wet signal with the dry signal so you can do something crazy. blend that in and this is a really powerful way that you can use gold clip. I've actually used it in this way for a couple of tracks where I needed that extra thickness. Now let's move to the gold section. We're gonna start with modern and this has a range of two and a half dB of non-linear gain that you can add. Let's push it and see what it does. No clipping, just the gold.
For a better way to AB, you can click the Unity, so we don't have that added uh, level boost. With the classic mode, we have more range, so we can push it a bit more. I like using the modern uh, algorithm with around 2 dB of gold. This sounds uh, best for me and it gives me that extra thickness, extra loudness on the tubas. With the alchemy, you can shape the top end further. Let's uh, hear it in action. Let's add some clipping. So you can see that this is a fairly complex plugin that interacts in a beautiful way with the source material. It has great tone shaping capabilities with the clipper, with the gold, which I absolutely love with the alchemy. I highly recommend trying the plugin yourself. I believe this on the tubas, this on drums, instruments and other stems works like a charm. It's an expensive plugin. I think it comes around uh, 200 uh, US, but they have like a rent to own a subscription uh, model you play every single month till you pay the full sum and that's a beautiful uh, business model. I highly recommend trying this uh, gold clip. I've been using it for a couple of months now. They've released already a couple of updates based on uh, the feedback of the community. Don't forget about the giveaway. Leave a comment down below and I will pick a random winner in two weeks. Thanks for the support and see you guys really, really soon. Cheers.